Good afternoon, students. Hello, teacher. Teacher, how are you today? How are you today? It's okay. Well, well, thank, you. thank you. What about you, you. teacher? Very well. I'm fine too. Thank you. thank you. My dear students, now you, you will watch a video. Please listen carefully and try to guess our today's topic, okay? Okay, teacher. Okay. Solar system. Solar system. Sun. sun. The sun the is sun very is big, big and hot. And hot. Sun. sun. There are Mercury, there are Mercury Venus, Venus, Earth, Earth Mars, Mars, Jupiter, Jupiter Saturn, Saturn, Uranus, Uranus and, Neptune. and Neptune. They go around, they go the, around sun. the sun. Solar system. This is our solar system. Solar system. Mercury, Mercury Venus, Venus, Earth, Earth Mars, Mars, Jupiter, Jupiter Saturn, Saturn, Uranus, Uranus Neptune, Neptune, and Sun. And sun. Mercury. 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 Mercury is the closest, is the closest planet, planet to the Sun. The sun. Venus. 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 Venus is the brightest the planet. Brightest in the sky. Earth. Earth is our planet. Mars. Mars is a red planet. Jupiter. Jupiter is the largest planet. Saturn. Saturn is the planet with the rings. Uranus. Uranus is very cold and cloudy. Neptune. Neptune is made of gas. Sun, Mercury, Venus, Earth, Earth, Mars, Mars Jupiter, Jupiter, Saturn, Saturn Uranus, 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 Neptune. Neptune. This, is Neptune. this is our solar system. So guys, I hope that you enjoyed the video. And for checking your understandings, please um, fill these sentences. Who wants to start? May I, teacher? Yes, of course. Start, Aidana. Uh, the biggest planet in the solar system is Jupiter. Yes, you're right. Okay, the next, who wants? May I, teacher? Yes, of course, Madina. The planet closest to the sun is Mercury. Am I right? Yes, of course, right you are. Okay, the next. The farthest planet uh, from the sun is Neptune. Yes, of course. You're right, Aidana. Thank you. May and the fourth? Yes, Arailo. Mars is sometimes called the red planet. Am I right? Nice of you, Arailo. Yes, you're right. Mm -hmm. The fifth? Who wants? May. Yes, Aidana. You may. Um, Venus is sometimes called the evening star. Yes, right, you are. That's the right answer. Okay, the yeah. sixth? <laughs> yes, season. The only planet that has life is uh, Earth. <laughs> nice of you, yes, of course, it's Earth. Mm -hmm. The last one, the seventh one, Adina? Yes, uh, the planets that have rings are Saturn and uh, Uranus. Yes, of course, right, you are. Thank you, my dear students. There are some discussion questions, please. Who wants to answer for the first question? How many planets are there in the solar system? May I? Yes, Madina, of course. 
there are eight planets uh, in the solar system. Yes, right you are. Aidana, do you want to visit another planet and why? Yes, actually, I think it is everyone's dream to visit another planet. But I think um, it would be good, it would be better if I visit Mars, because everyone praising mm -hmm. that uh, it's in, it's possible to live there. Thank you. And mm -hmm. Arela, in what planet do you want to live? Mm, actually, uh, I didn't think about it, but uh, I really want to visit all this planet. But if or maybe one I will like, uh, maybe it's uh, Saturn, I would like to live there. Wow, nice of you. And can you guess what is the theme of our lesson? Today? About mm -hmm. solar. Yes. About solar system. Yes, yeah, right, you are sure. Our today's topic is connected with space, Earth, and also solar system. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, let's learn uh, the new words according to our today's topic. First is space. This is where the stars and planets are. Planet. Any of the large round objects that move around the sun. Climate. The word for the typical weather in one place. Sunrise. The time in the morning when the sun appears. Earth. The name of the planet we live on. Universe. This is everything that exists. Space stars and planets. It was our new vocabulary. It's time to get in the grammar part. Our today's grammar part include past simple and past continuous tenses. We use past simple tense for finished events in the past which have a definite time. And in narrative, the structure of the past simple tense is the second form of the verb and adding ed to the verb. And the past continuous tense, we use past continuous tense to describe a continuing unfinished action in the past and for a continuing unfinished action interrupted by a sudden past action. The structure of the past continuous tense was where plus verb ing. Aidana, can you read the first example of past simple tense? Okay. In 1969, the first man landed on the moon. Yes, thank you. You see, the yes. action was finished in past and have a definite time. In this case, we use past simple. Okay, mm -hmm. Susan, can you read the next yes. example of past simple tense? The door opened and two boys came into the room. Yes, thank you. And RLM, can you read the past continuous tense example? Uh, yes, sure. I looked out of the window and saw that it was raining. Okay, thank you. And who wants to read the last example? May I, teacher? Yes, you may. While I was getting ready for bed, the doorbell rang. Okay, thank you. Nice of you. And it's time to practice your understanding. You should choose one of these two variants and then fill the gaps. Please, who wants to start? May I, teacher? Okay, Arelum, you may start. Uh, I started work at 9 a.m. this morning. Yes, of course. Nice of you. Thank you. The next is. May I? And May I? You? Yes, yes, of course. Uh, this time last year, I was studying at university. Yes, of course. Nice of you. The third. Mm -hmm. What? May I? Yes, yes, Ranat. Uh -huh. What were you doing at around uh, 8 a.m. this morning? Nice to meet you. Yes, that's the right answer. The last one, the fifth, for I uh, While I was washing the dishes, I suddenly had a bri brilliant idea. Right, you are. Nice of you, my dear students. 
Now it's time for a group work. We should divide into groups. We, ha we will have uh, two groups. Firstly, I will ask one question and who uh, will answer first may choose a person to your team. So guys, what do you think? What is the only planet we know of that has life is? Which planet? Hey, is it Venus or Mercury? Yeah. Yes, Arielum, you may. Please answer. Earth. Earth. Yes, right, you are. Nice of you. And uh, choose one partner to you for your mm. team. Oh, Janar. Okay. And Arielum and Janar will be in the first team, and the others you will you will be in the second team. The first team is Earth and the second is Sun. I'll give you the text about okay. mission to Mars. Please read the text carefully and try to answer to these questions below. We, I give you two minutes. Is it enough? Yes. 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 Okay. I finished your teacher. Wow. Nice of you. So, can you start? Yes. Which group is going to be yes. the first? Uh, we are the group that's called Earth. Uh, me and Arayla. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. We want to answer to the question, uh, what is the writer doing in the text? Um, I think okay. uh, writer uh, speaks to all of the humanity. Uh, I think uh, he said that uh, humanity explored a lot of the things. Uh, on, mm -hmm. which is located on the earth. I will continue. So the writer is saying in this text about the great experience of humanity. He said that humans love to explore and uh, for a lot of years uh, humanity explored uh, the highest, coldest uh, places on earth and uh, we uh, have um, Eight years later, the Neil Armstrong was the first human to walk on the moon. He said about the last experience of the humanity and the next future uh, plans of the humanity. The future plans, uh, they turning out attention to Mars. It's their new plan. Super. Thank you, Janar. Thank you, Arelum. It was the great answer. So, what about the second group? Jan, are you here? Yes. Okay, you may start. Uh, our group uh, Sun, uh, Aidana, Madina. Uh, what does the writer say in paragraph uh, second? So, mm -hmm. uh, in paragraph, um, uh, writer says said about uh, Mars and Mars temperatures uh, so high. That's why uh, humans can uh, can go there. Next, Adana will continue. Yes, of course. Um, so why Mars? Because all the scientists now, all the scientists nowadays, uh, tend to explore this planet because um, compared to other planets, uh, this planet is this planet is the coldest one. By the way, the temperature is um, like a uh, lower than others. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But uh, and also like Jupiter and Saturn are the big balls with full of gases, and mm -hmm. because uh, it's impossible to live there. But nowadays scientists uh, are uh, thinking that mm -hmm. maybe living in Mars will be possible. Nice of you, girls. Yes, of course. Right, you are. You are so clever, students. I'm really proud of each of you. That's your home task. Be ready for the next lesson. And our lesson is come up to the end. In today's lesson, we discussed about the solar system, about the space and Earth. Also, we get acquainted with new grammar and new vocabulary. Our grammar part was about past simple and past continuous tense. Is everything clear to you or? Do you have some that was really interesting. I have no question. Everything is clear. Thank you so much. That's great that you don't have any questions. But by the way, if you have any questions, please text me and so give feedback about our today's lesson. 
circle appropriate number um, one is not a row and five is extremely but the, this lesson topic was helpful the lesson was easy to understand and the lesson held my attention okay please okay. send your answers to me to the chat so our today's lesson is over thank you for your active participation you're really clever students thank you thank you too. thank you teacher goodbye Goodbye. Have a nice day. Goodbye. 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 Thank you, you too. Thank you.